Hi there everyone and welcome to this video. In this video I'll be solving differential equations in MATLAB Simulink. So let's get started. Suppose that you're given these equations representing a loudspeaker and as you can see we have an equation of order 1 and the second one of order 2 and we're asked to plot i and y for a given value of v as well as the constant values so the first step to solving these equations in MATLAB Simulink is to rearrange them so that the term with the highest order will be on the left side and the remaining terms will be on the right side so let's do that and as you can see they look something like this so now go to MATLAB and Simulink library and now we have to create a new model from here then we should go to commonly used blocks in order to add the necessary components so we need gain so click on it and drag as well as um, integrator and then we need some we need also scope we have sine wave so we start building the first one as you can see we need an integrator so this is it the second thing that we need is sum we need sum so this is the sum and we have three signs plus minus minus so double click the sum simple and change it to rectangular and just write plus minus minus you can resize it to look appropriate for you we start with the first term which is V so V is given as sign so it represents the input to the system so this is V and we can change it so go back to your equation and you'll see that the amplitude is 2 so we just write 2 and now the frequency is 3 now click on OK. Double click on sine wave and write V. Now we go to the second term of our equation which is KY dot. That means K is just a gain. So we need this gain and control R to rotate and K value is 2.5. So double click and write 2.5 okay and write here k and this term is minus so we link it to minus connect the integrator on the sum and now we need bi and as you can see that b is just a gain so just try it b and its value is as given here 1 and now you can connect it as minus and we've got i so we, we've got here i prime and here i double click here and write I so now we're done with the first equation we go to the second one and as you can see we need the integrator two times just try to click on it and drag it and again do the same thing connect them together and here we have Y prime and here Y 
and here also we've got y double prime from this equation we can see that we need sum so this is it you can link it double click and we have just two signs plus and minus okay notice that the first term is ki so we've got i from here but we don't have k delete this one we need again which is k and as you can see k is ready here so we connect it with i so this is i and it's positive the second term is minus a y dot it means that we need another gain so this is it and rename it as a and change its value to 2 and ok and now just link them together this is y dot and now we have just one thing left which is ky dot or ky prime so it's connected right now and as you can see the output of the system is y and i so we need a scope and this is it just connect it to i right click and drag and connect it to i and now you can just run it and finally results can be obtained from the scope double click on it and this is it for i and the second thing which is y is this one so this is the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching please don't forget to subscribe like and share bye